you are not godly the ethics of that realm necessitates that you are cultured you cannot be a hooligan and find yourself in that realm so when you are in that realm and you are misbehaving sooner or later the body language of that realm will drive you out because you have not gotten there honorably you can escort a friend to that realm and with with digital precision they will fish you and say sorry let's show you a way out because something about your mental disposition betrays you there are people who are men of god but you have not sustained the intelligence the discipline the diplomacy the leadership and the spirituality to be given a mic to speak over a church you will start with a teenage group don't fight stay there make your mistakes embarrass yourself forget the verses misquote scripture make theological mistakes and grow when you grow you can have a little youth church they can say okay lead prayers lead praise and worship don't stand and say you are insulting me you don't know when i started ministry it is not the passage of time chronos it is the transition that is in your mind when it has to do with mental transformation overtaking is allowed are we together watch this you can be due for promotion but the manager knows what he's looking for he's not just looking for certificates he's looking for a requisite level of mental traits that befits that office and it is true that you have stayed that long in terms of the the time requirement but the truth is that as honest as you are you have not been able to sustain the kind of mental transformation that represents that company well it is not always tribalism every great leader here every ceo here will agree with what i'm saying it's true you can destroy a company and they will lose hundreds of millions because of one act that is a reflection of an inferior understanding someone can lobby a relationship that is millions of dollars worth and you just come carelessly and destroy it in the name of speaking your mind are you seeing that now you don't like what i'm saying we'll, we'll soon wrap up and, and go away I'm, I'm a christian but i'm when i'm angry i give it to people the way it is you will remain poor if you talk like that because the bible said be wise as serpents did you know that one of the advantage of a serpent is his silence a serpent is not noisy it does not roar you know a lion is coming but you may not know a serpent is there and he says be as wise as that not everything observed is what speaking about let's pray in tongues for one minute Manda braska de belekato shalas. My life is shifting for sure. My life is changing for sure. My church is changing for sure. My business is shifting for sure. Hallelujah. Please sit down. One of the principles that is globally employed in leadership is that as you grow as a leader, you must begin to train and mentor the people that follow you to acclimatize to the mental construction that befits the realm you are transiting into otherwise you will be the only person who has transited and the people behind you will draw you back they are the depravity of their understanding will sabotage your efforts this is true for churches so you have a man of god who will grow he's now meeting new relationships international people but the core leaders that work with him are still localized their thinking is still localized and if given the opportunity they will sabotage profitable relationships you are not safe until everything around you grows with you you don't grow alone when you grow let your wife grow with you please hear what i'm saying 
because the version of you will be looking for the equivalent of the version of her and if you grow alone you will get to a point where you will be surprised why you are not connecting your language your love is there but your language is changing you are speaking and and dealing with people at a particular dimension that there is no there is no equivalence in that relationship it's why people who knew you before will get angry and say you used to know me you don't pick my calls now it's not about being bad is that you have grown and the truth is that if they do not grow with you in as much as you love them the gap will be too much you may be forced to wave them goodbye because they become an interruption to your focus you will always have to turn back to wave them please don't feel guilty if you edit your relationships on account of growth you will be persecuted but it's an honorable one time will justify you we were all classmates when we were growing up i agree but are you willing to grow are we not all fellow men of god i agree but are you willing to grow be careful the kind of people you introduce to your space because as you are transiting your space is fragile and you will need to bring people who represent an advantage to that realm do not sabotage the sacrifice of years because of